Must be easier riding a bucking bronco than one of these trials bikes. Believe me, they're better left to the professionals. I can leave that with you, thank you. But the whole point of this exercise wasn't the trials bike at all. It was the pictures that were being taken of me from the vehicle over here with the cameraman on top. And whilst the vehicle was travelling through this rough country, it was almost impossible for the cameraman to hold the camera still. And this is always the problem when you're trying to take pictures on the move. But there's a new piece of equipment that's been developed that should make the camera a much more flexible instrument. It's a remote-controlled, gyro-balanced camera platform, all wrapped up inside this glass fibre cocoon. The thing is to get rid of all the bumps and the vibrations that are going through the vehicle. And although the camera and the platform are suspended on a very well-sprung boom across the top, and independently of the plastic cocoon here, obviously a lot of the movement is still going to get through to the camera. And that's what this black box is all about. This irons out the last of all the vibrations because inside it there are three gyros controlling movement in three dimensions for roll, pitch and yaw. The camera itself is on the other side here, this is the film camera part of it, and attached to the side is a television camera. And incidentally, it's identical to the camera that was used inside the spaceship on the Apollo missions. This television camera is taking exactly the same picture as the film camera, but it's transmitting the picture to a monitor screen inside the vehicle. And that's where the cameraman sits. He watches the picture on the monitor screen and controls the camera from a remote control console in front of him. the monitor screen here and the control panel which really couldn't be more simple the focus knob is on the top here and underneath it the zoom and on the other side here the tilt up and down and the pan from side to side this knob doesn't move it simply reacts to pressure from the fingers for this test the unit has been specially mounted on an army vehicle driving over uneven ground and this is the result a gyro-stabilised picture completely unaffected by any of the bumps. As the vehicle crashes across the rough heathland, the jolt might prove too much, but the cameraman sees a steady picture. The great advantage of this system is the remote camera control. Without the added weight of a cameraman, the module can be easily mounted on the roof of a car or the hook of a crane and still give perfectly stable pictures under the most rugged conditions. Alas! The 8mm home movie version has yet to be developed.